Welcome back guys to another beer review. Today's beer is a collaboration from Vocation and Yeasty Boys and it's a can of their Breakfast Club Waffle and Blueberry Breakfast Stout coming at 6.9%. 440 ml can, uh, got this from Tesco's, three pound. No, it's been out for a while. Uh, I was hoping I'd pick up the, 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 the version two of this if you like, but turns out I ended up picking up the version one so even though you've seen this lots you're going to see it another time now if you watch it so I do apologize for that but here we go another beer with you so let's get it open get it in the glass quite cool looking can wrap sort of set it all on the can wrap Ooh, I can smell the blueberries. It's about to smell the sweet blueberry smell there with the stout. Colour wise, quite hard in my room, so I've got I've got the man cave back now, so I've got like the LED lights on. So although it does give it a tinge, when I was pouring it you could tell it was sort of like a black with a, a blueberry hint in the colour. We got a thing for a spacious tan head. Even maybe a little pink in there, but again, it could be the light, so I'm not sure. So uh, let's get in there with the nose, see what we get. Oh yeah, the blueberry big time in there. With that typical stout kind of richness to it. Sweet. Yeah, it smells, it smells really nice. Uh, Let's dive in. Cheers. Hmm. Yeah, that's nice. It's not going to be everyone's cup of tea. Obviously, the blueberry thing is going to be down to whether you like blueberries or not, or the sweetness. A slight bit of carbonation in the mouth. Quite a nice body to the beer. Not real thick and heavy. Pretty nice. You're getting the sweetness. They're sort of like a coffiness in the background of the taste. That's nice. I wouldn't necessarily say I'm getting the waffle sort of smell in there. Or taste, I should say. There's a, a hint of vanilla for me so on the taste wise for me you're getting blueberry obviously you get a bit of vanilla you're getting subtle coffee in the background which I would say is your typical sort of stout sort of taste a bit of carbonation in the mouth as you drink it Yeah, not a bad body on it. Uh, percentage? When you sit and, sit and think about it, uh, maybe on the back end you're getting a touch of the percentage coming through, but very little for me. But this is nice. Uh, it's not the right time time of year to be drinking it to be fair although where I'm living it's a bit cooler at the moment so that's why I thought I'd do a stout yeah it's almost like a, it's almost like a stout with uh, a Ribena stout or Vimto if you like uh, but it's nice 
the coffee gives it a very, it's like I said, very subtle coffee, and you're getting that subtleness in the bitterness. It, it's it's very minimal the bitterness in there, but it's a nice drink. Uh, I remember having it the first time. Uh, I was blown away by it. I've had a few more stouts since. This is edition three, so whether the mix is any different, but I was blown away by the first the first one I had, the first batch. Excuse me. Not so blown away by it this time. I would probably say it feels a little bit thinner. But it is a really nice drink. It's definitely a wintry drink. I sit by the fire. Put your feet up, watch film, kind of beer. So, uh, yeah, as I said, got this from Tesco, it's three pound. Is it worth the money? Yeah, I'd say, yeah, it's it's worth the money. You're certainly getting something different with it. Uh, so if you fancy trying a can, get yourself down there. Like I said, location Yeasty Boys breakfast waffle stout. The version two actually has a different uh, picture on the front. So, if you see that one, that's the original one. If you see a different picture, you know you're getting a new one. Uh, so, please feel free to comment. Uh, always like a bit of interaction, like your videos, subscribe to my channel. Uh, thanks for watching everyone. Whatever you're drinking, enjoy. As I am. And uh, I'll see you again on another beer review. Good night, cheers.